I guess we're going to look at Todd Bodine's car for the intro. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to JK Gaming. Obviously, it's me, uh, your boy. But we are here not simming 20 years of NASCAR Thunder 2003. Instead, we're going to do the lightning challenges. Shout out Alex Belmonte 4581. Uh, I had planned on doing this, but it was cool to hear somebody say they wanted to see me do it. So we are going to do it. Um, so I have been saying this entire time. This is really loud. We're going to go back out of this. I have been saying this entire time I have not played this game. I got this game actually mixed up with NASCAR Thunder 2004. I did not play 04. Now, I can't even really say I didn't. I did play this game because literally all I've ever done in this game was the the big one, Lightning Challenge. So, I have I have at least done that one. We're going to see how many tries it takes me to beat it. Um, I pretty much beat it when I was a kid and was like, yeah, that's... That's enough for me. So, yeah, I haven't even done a bunch of these. I'm very excited. Um, they get very hard. I have no idea how long this is going to take me to do. I have no no idea how many there even are. So, yeah, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna hop into it. Uh, the Dale Jr. one was the first one it was on. Actually, no, you know what? We're gonna start with Mike Skinner at the Aaron's 499 at Talladega. We're going to see if I can miss a big one because we all know I damn well. We all know damn well if you've seen any of my iRacing content that I can't. So we're going to give it a go. How would you like to see this happening in front of you? I hate seeing well, that happen in, in front of me, Mike. in the 2002 Aaron's 499 at Talladega, I found myself coming off of turn two, the big one. Oh, oh we're already causing issues. I don't want to be up top. I already know that. They're all wrecking. They're all wrecking. Oh my God, Steve Park. Oh my God. What a start. What? What a start. Steve Park lands on our windshield. I just realized this is not in full screen. That's great. Thanks, game. How am I out of contention? Oh. Oh, there they all go. What do you mean damage? The car's fine. I wonder if I should just full throttle through. This is attempt number four, by the way. We're going to see what... No, I'm just going to run in the back of them. And flip horrendously. This is the attempt. We're going to do it on this one. I don't know. I think this is number six. Yes. I called it. You fuck nerds. Why is my lap time 14 and a half minutes? Oh, it would be awful to go off the racing surface at this point and lose this. I think that's a thing I've done before. You're not taking ninth away from me, Ward. Stay back, heathen. Yes. I think that's five attempts. We beat the big one, finally. Would have been cooler if I did it on the first, but it's fine. Of course, Dale Jr. wins. Kyle Petty gets a top five because, of course, he does. Wow. Well, since we did one at Talladega, we might as well do the other Talladega. Oh, well, one of maybe one of the other ones. I don't know if there's other ones, but... Let's, uh, let's, let's see what we've got. I don't even know what to do in this one, but we're going to try it again. Or try this one. Try it again. I haven't tried it. Okay, guys, you knew this one was coming. In October of 2001, I, I won the first EA Sports 500 at Talladega. Talk about perfect, huh? The biggest gamer in racing wins the race sponsored by the biggest video game and computer game company in the world. All right, I guess all we really have to do is get to the front and win. It seems like a easy thing to do, I guess. Number 30, he's gaining on you. Got one down left. Oh, uh, we're not, not going to do it on this try, I don't think. Also, I like how Dale Jr. admitted he's a gamer. NASCAR's biggest gamer wins the gamer race. Oh, see you, Matt Kenseth. Sorry, buddy. You're clear. The 30 car wants to get by you. I don't care if the 30 wants to get by me. He can't. They're gone. We're fucked. 
It's uh, this is rookie challenges, man. What do you? How am I supposed to do this? Keep in mind the tri is really far away. They never let you forget on a broadcast. Oh my god, are we going to do it? Are we going to No, we're going to half a car length short. Oh, wow. <laughs> you know, it's really unfortunate we had to wreck Matt Kenseth on the last one. And Matt Kenseth kind of cost us. Oh, we're going to do it again, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how to drive. Here we come. Dive bomb. Oh. <laughs> Let's dive bomb. Ride the apron and run up into Jeff Burton. That's great. I love it. The Intimidator Jr. Yeah, get out of here, Tony Stewart. I love how he just slammed on the brakes. He just let me have it. Thanks, Tony. Hell yeah. That was really delayed. Hell yeah, but we did it. Two down, like... 30 to go or some shit. Wow. I suppose we'll do this one. I think we're Jeff Burton, maybe. I don't know. I have no idea. This is... We're going to find out, I guess. That guy there knows it's not true. All right. We're controlling Jeff Burton. And Jeff said... Or Mark Mark said... Excuse me, not Jeff. Mark said we're, we know Jeff's not the best. Well, I know neither of you are the best. I'm the best. That's why I'm here. As I immediately run it into the wall. That's. You're clear. I'm great. Oh, the Kyle Larson line does not work. All right, we got a lap to get him. I don't see this going well. We might just see you at the uh, at the next one, or we're gonna catch him, and it's gonna be a photo finish, or I'm gonna get it really loose. That's great. That's fine. We've, you know, we'll just keep trying it. Wow, big leg. You okay? I'm fine. A little less fine. Okay. Uh, we did we did not almost have it all right so uh, notes taken during the first one don't hit the wall that's a great start I like how Mark Martin's car in the preview said Mark Martin on it and not Pfizer and now it says Pfizer well at least we're close much better than last time. Okay. <laughs> well, attempt number three after pulling a Tyler Reddick. Good lord. bang it up if I want to. I don't have to fix it. Oh, God. I'm just letting him think he has a chance, guys. It's okay. There's grip up there, I promise. Your big run. Side by side, down the back stretch, into three and four. Jeff Burton takes the lead. And the crowd goes mild as he drives it up into the wall again. Oh my god. I suck. Not gonna get close enough to try and wreck him or anything. Wow. <laughs> this is rookie too. This is embarrassing. On the bright side, at least if I embarrass myself in the Thunder Challenges before doing a career mode, everybody's expectations will be a lot lower going into the career mode. Wow, he got a hell of a run through the corner. 
No. Oh, oh no. Power move on the outside. Or not. I don't want to take it easy on the tires. Stop telling me what to do. I'm a grown man. Do what I want. Oh, it gets really, really sketchy off of four. I will say that. Excuse me. Rubbin's racing. That's my answer to that. Oh, and sailing it off into turn four like an absolute asshole. Oh, this is gonna be close. Oh, you fucker. Oh, you got him! <laughs> wow. That was close. Wow. All right, we get to drive as the goat. If you watch the 20 year sim, you know. Oh my, oh wow. Yikes, careful buddy. Yeah. I, we drifted all of three in, into four and gained that much on him. Oh wait, we're racing Steve Park. I'm just improving the arrow, it's fine. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I'm sure our sponsors don't want to see a beat up car, buddy. I'm sure they'd want to see a car in victory lane, which be careful. We'll get there eventually. I wasn't out of contention. If you'd let me save it. See you later, Steve Park. I'm out of here, you bozo. Be careful, you're using up those tires. I'm just showing off, crew chief. Oh god. Oh god. We'll be back for another shot at this point. Showed off too much. Oh god. No shit. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Intimidate button. Number one. It's got to run on you. You're clear. Gotta no. Tires in good shape to be okay, now if we can just manage to not die, we should be okay. Number one. Up high. Clear all around. Yikes, careful, buddy. Oh, Yo, that yeah, bastard. Man. I'm the bastard. You a UPS car and a Pennzoil car at Darlington. This, I mean, it's already ended so well so many times. Why, why does the car do that? Get out of here. Go away. Leave me alone. You're mean. That was a Ross Chastain and Joey Logano joke. Neither one of those ended very well. If you know, you know. Oh my gosh. You sure you're a professional? No, I'm far from it, crew chief. Thank you for the reminder. Steve Park, what the hell do you want? Probably to win the race, if I had to guess. Oh my god, again? We'll get there, you better back off, I'm crazy. Okay, we're clear. Oh, boy, oh my god. Yikes, careful. I'm trying to be careful. I'm trying to be careful. Oh, white flag! We finally have made it this far. I don't know how many attempts this has taken, but my lord. Wow. Another wreck avoidance one. I like this. This sounds fairly self explanatory. We just have to miss a wreck. Okay. Attempt number three. Do it for Dale. Oh my god. 
I have to do this without getting a scratch on the car. I don't know if the game has seen me drive. Wow. I was going to say, I don't know if the game has seen me drive other tracks. Now I just need to not hit anything for the last two corners. Oh my god! This game has seen me driving. Oh, that's technically damage. I should be out of it, and I'm not. Oh, and... We're <laughs> Number 32, sound left. Oh my god. I've just come to the... The realization that this game hates me. Oh my god. I'm upset. Going high finally paid off. Don't touch him. Stay away from me, Mark Martin. Yes. Oh my god. This game hates me. Wow. We get to race as Ricky Craven? On a sunny October Monday, I got the first Winston Cup Series win at the 2001 Old Dominion 500 at Martinsville. Congratulations. The race was postponed from Sunday due to rain. And remember, nobody cares how banged up your car is in the winter circle, as long as you're in the winter circle. No, but Ricky Craven said it doesn't matter how banged up your car is. Reckless driving. That wasn't reckless. <laughs> the last line of that thing was literally, it does not matter how banged up your car is. Or we can just pull half a straightaway on him. Might have been the easiest one yet. Wow. Well, there's 30 of these things. And you know what? It took Jimmy Johnson three seasons to get a win in the 20 year sim. We might as well get him a win here. Not me, Jimmy Johnson. No. No way. I don't care about my reputation. It's a lightning challenge. Leave me alone, crew chief. Speaking of reputations, this guy behind me. Stay away from me, Kurt Busch. We don't need a Richmond uh, the late 2000s incident. Oh, God. Come back here. Uh, this is not going to end well. Oh, yes. <laughs> Perfect. Well executed. Heck yeah. This is the first time I've one shot one. Let's go. Woo, we did it. Yep, that's exactly how it was drawn up. Wow. All right, we're back. I took a little break. Um, I think we're just going to knock out these super speedway ones because why not? I'm, I'm really nervous about... Uh, I'm uh, really nervous about how difficult these are going to be if I'm struggling this hard on Rookie with these ones. So we'll see what happens. No, you don't. No, you don't. Ricky Craven's up here. I talked about this. Ricky Craven's always up front. I just realized I didn't talk for a lap and a half. I mean, I just woke up, to be fair. It's like 6.30 in the morning. Why does it look like everybody has damage in the mirror? Tony Stewart's... Oh boy, left front fender. 
was hanging off in my mirror. Well, he's not gonna. I like how all the super speedway ones are rookie. Control the lanes. Control the lanes. The start finish line isn't for another mile and a half. Easy peasy, baby. Finally. Another one shot. First challenge of the day, one shot at bitches. Uh, yes, I recorded these over multiple days, by the way, in case you were in case you were curious. Wow. Coming to the white flag, one lap to go. Presented by credit one bank. I see Ryan Newman back there. You're gonna have to wait till 2008, pal. Mark Martin's just gonna have to keep waiting because he never won a Daytona 500. Sorry, Mark Martin. Oh. Are we gonna back-to-back -back one shot this? We are because they're not gonna. I'm not gonna let them pass me. Yeah, I know he is. It's fucking plate racing, spotter. You dummy. Kinda how this shit works. Daytona 500! Woo! Awesome job, buddy. Thank you. Wow. At the end of the Pepsi 400 in Daytona in 2001, I found myself in a pretty familiar spot, running 1-2 with Dale Earnhardt Jr. I do have to say, out of all the all the recorded messages I've watched, um, Mikey has the best so far. He's very, very good with the camera. You dickhead. I see Mikey found the rocket fuel well before, uh, oh shit, what year was that? Whatever, whatever. I see. I even talked about this during the sim. I think I might not have talked about it during the sim, but when Michael Waltrip Racing got busted for tampering with their carburetor, or oh my God, where are you going, Dale Jr.? What the hell was that? <laughs> Let's not leave the racing surface, please. No, you don't, buddy. No, you don't. Mikey's time to shine, baby. Yay, another easy super speedway challenge. Wow. This time it was my turn. Now it's your turn. Tony said it's my turn. And we're back to mile and a half, so where I don't know how to make the corner. Ooh. Also, I'm pretty sure I said when I recorded the first little bit I recorded that, uh, I'm pretty sure I said that uh, I hope that Ricky Craven and Kurt Busch finishes on here. That's going to be in 2004 because this is all 2001 challenges. Excuse me, coming through. Get the hell out of my way! Break the side draft. Notoriously, whoever's on the outside at Atlanta wins. Oh, we got by him. I don't care what the 22 car wants. Oh, no. Dale Jr. out of nowhere. Good thing we're on the outside. Oh, we're not going to do it doing that. Wow. Um, how did we, one, how did we not wreck, but we totally choked. Oh, 
my lord. Wow. I will fully admit I don't know how I did that, how I saved it. Is he though? Is he gaining on me? Number eight, Dale Jr., go away. This is my challenge to win, bub. Tony Stewart would do the same thing. <laughs> wow. Oh God. Oh, we're gonna lose. Don't don't worry about what just happened with me and Bobby Labonte. Why is Ricky Craven always up here? It's fine. We can still win this. I don't know how the hell to get around Rockingham in this game. Fuck. Oh, fuck. And we're also a challenge winner. Get fucked, nerds. Ignore the donuts on the door. Wow. Casey at with the race leader, feeling the heat now, big time from Bill Elliott. Elliott is there. The 2001 Pennzoil Freedom 400 at Homestead, I took the pole and went on to win. To do that, I had to pass my teammate Casey Atwood with less than five laps to go. But that win put Dodge back into the winner's circle for the fourth time in 2001 and brought Ray Abraham back there for the first time as a team owner. So you've got five laps to go at Homestead and the number 19 Dodge and Trevitt is in front of you. Ah uh, yes, flat homestead, where we're still going to rip the fence. I hope I remember to put this in here. Bill Elliott said I was chasing the number 19 Dodge. That is the number 7 Dodge. See, that, that's a 7, not a 19. Smell you later, fool. Maybe. It's like a mile and a half New Hampshire, Jesus. I would say at least I don't have to worry about hitting the wall or running the top, but I have already hit the wall. No, I'm an idiot. I wish I could set my wheel and pedals up to play this game. It'd be so much nicer. I had to rip the fence one time. Let everybody know that I'm the king. Sterling Marlin, go away. I took it easy on you. I give you an A plus on that one, buddy. I got an A plus. First time in my life. Wow. Oh God, more Darlington. I won here once before in the 2000, and with three to go in the 201 Mountain Dew Southern 500, I had the lead. 
Dot <laughs> com. And go see that fucking guy over there. <laughs> All right, here we go. The 201 Mountain Dew Southern 500. I love that Ward said 201. He also said Caterpillar Dog. Get the fuck out of here, Jeff Gordon. This is my challenge. Fuck you. I'm the star here. Oh, no. Here we go again. Darlington Stripe for good measure. Fuck you. Oh, God. We're all over the place. Oh, sorry. Didn't see you there, pal. That... Okay, I will say the Jeff Gordon one was on purpose. The Bobby Labonte one, not as much. No! We saved it! Oh, this is a train wreck of a challenge. Yeah, it's, thank God it's over. <laughs> oh my God. That was horrible. Poor car. Wow. With 16 oh, laps to go, a few of us got together and brought out the final year. Great first attempt. No, what the fuck? Well, it'd be nice if it wouldn't fucking spin me! Don't you do it. Don't you motherfucker. Oh my god. I don't know how to get into one and two without literally sliding and almost dying every time. I mean, for fuck's sake. I mean, in true Robbie Gordon fashion, we might as well wreck three quarters of the field. God bless. Take it easy on those tires. The 20 car is up high. You can't win a race if there's no car to finish with. You know what they I say? I beg to differ. The 40 car wants to get by you. All clear, buddy. The 24 car is up high. I don't know which one was worse. I don't know which one was worse, but it's done. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was horrible. Wow. If anyone ever tells you that something cannot be done, remind them of this story that proves anything can be done. As is customary at Bristol, I gotta rip the rip the fence. Sure Even when I should be running the bottom. Yeah, I'm a professional. Well, it'd be nice if I didn't suck. The 43 car has got a run on you. Number 43, sell up. No way, bro. What the fuck? That was a good effort, though. Fuck this. I heard that was such a hard hit, I heard it in both earphones. Good lord. I don't give me an A plus. Not on that one. Wow. Come here, boy. Oh no. Wouldn't be Martinsville with body slamming, would not be Martinsville without body slamming somebody out of the way. Good run. 
Hell oh, yeah, brother. Wow. Yay, more holding people off at a track that I'm not very good at already in my experience here. Oh, sorry, Dale Jr. Oh, sorry, me. Sorry again, Dale Jr. Well, I totally fucked this up. Oh wow. <laughs> no no shot. No shot. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Wow. That actually was a pretty good tunnel turn. They're catching me though. Good god. Probably doesn't help that I keep doing that. Where's Dale Jr. at? Is he back there behind Michael Walter? Is that Waltrip anyways? I don't know. The 20 car is coming left. Oh no, there's Dale Jr. He's in third. Oh my god, Tony Stewart just hopped the curb. Okay, that might have been the most impressive thing I've Go seen. Yeah, baby! That was awesome. Tony Stewart with a friggin' sweet ass. Wow. I think we're catching them, boys. Oh, yeah. Big gains. Here comes Tony Stewart. Number 99. Up high. Swing and a miss. Oh, boy. I swung and missed. That was me. That was my fault. Oh boy. Well, this is going a lot better than the Jeff Burton Mark Martin challenge. I actually know what I'm doing now. Heck yeah, baby. Not first try, it's second try. Oh, it, well, maybe. <laughs> second try! I forgot to turn in the first one. Hell yeah. Wow. Let's you and me get it on right here. I'm not sure what to do. I don't, I've seen this challenge done. I don't know if I should save fuel. Try and save fuel. I don't know how to save fuel. Or if I should go like hell. I guess we'll try... I don't know. Try to just win the challenge. <laughs> oh, that's not going to help my efforts. I will say Bobby Labonte in saying, let's get it on in the video made me feel very uncomfortable. I think no matter what, I'm going to run out of fuel. I should have just tried to build a big old lead. Uh-oh. No! No! <laughs> oh, damn, we almost did it. 
We almost did it. I would have been pretty pumped. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm driving for Hendrick Motorsports. You're telling me that they can't, like, you know, run the fuel line through the chassis or something? That's all them bastards do is cheat. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. Motherfucker Kevin Harvick snuck by. Okay, so the saving one seemed to go a little better. We're gonna try and go that route again because we ran out in one and two that time. Alright, a lot of pressure. Let's see where we run out this lap. Number 18 is passing low. No, you don't. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. He just followed me. Wow. If you've watched any Venom Truck series, you know I can be an all-star. Easy. Easy money. Oh, no. Oh, uh, it's easy money now. Unless they're gonna attach friggin' rockets to Jeff Gordon, which they might. I didn't mean to do that. But this just made this challenge extremely easy. I'm surprised Jeff Gordon didn't just catch me. Off turn four, Terry Labotti, 1999 All Star winner. Hell yeah, baby. Wow. Another one at Charlotte. I'm starting to enjoy this track, actually. I say that and then immediately go up to the wall in three and four. Just customary. Brian Newman, notoriously hard to pass. Me, not so much. Just wait for me to fuck up in three and four. There it is. Oh my god. <laughs> god bless, dude. I don't know why the car does things sometimes that it does. I'm playing dirty. I'm not playing dirty. Uh, that's his fault. He turned into me in the dog leg. I'm convinced. Well, we'll see at the end of the challenge because assuming I don't go off track, this should be done. Why are you the way that you are? Remind me not to ride anywhere with you. No, what? Don't bang it up too bad. Finally, white flag. Oh my lord. Oh, 
Oh, no. Whatever. Leaving my market, Charlotte. Ryan Newman, all-star. Yes. Wow. I have not talked. Uh, Flat Vegas. Trying to beat Jeremy Mayfield two laps. Number 19, we'll just move him out of the way. Move, bitch. Get out the way. Oh, he got a big run, huh? Oh, we're three wide middle. Customary at every flat track, run the wall. Oh, Jeremy, why? Oh, Ward's fast, huh? No, it didn't stick. Dang it. Oh, I won. I won? How did I win? Oh, Ward was late. <laughs> I had no idea. Wow. Well, I know how this ends. Probably with me driving into the wall wow. multiple times. Okay. Well, we know how this ended in real life. Oh, my God. Go right now. Oh, he hit him. Go. Bush got under him and muscled Jimmy Spencer. You don't see that often. Number 41. Surely three wide at Bristol is a good idea. God bless. Oh, we blew up. We like actually blew up. There we go. Oh, God bless. If I could figure out how to make it turn, I would, crew chief. Oh my God, bro. I have to keep it true to history, okay, guys? No. Oh my gosh, finally. Wow. Tell you what, if I blow this again, I'm gonna be mad. But these challenges definitely are getting hard. There we go. Let's go. I wish it would let me do the burnout. That was awesome. So much for that challenge. We did it! Yay! Wow. I'll be honest. I didn't watch the video. I didn't even look at what the challenge said to do, but. Rip the fence at a flat track. You're clear. Oh wow, Sterling Marlin's really fast. I don't know if we can catch him with two laps left, but we're gonna try. Oh, shit, sorry Rusty. Clear all right. Oh, we might have a shot. Cross him over. Side draft. Run him over. I don't know how I saved it. I don't know how I didn't get, how I didn't wreck Sterling Marlin. I don't know how I didn't get reckless driving and we're just gonna block Kurt Busch. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what we're looking for. One shot. <laughs> wow. Good Lord, five laps of Pocono. I'll either see you when I wreck or when I win.
No, uh... No, motherfucking bitch. God bless America. Oh, I did not mean to do that, but that works. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, yes, finally. It only took 25 minutes. And I still suck at Pocono, but we did it. Wow. All right, I talked about it. Let's be about it. I don't know what I've talked about to be about, but I talked about we were coming back to Homestead as Casey Atwood. Oh, God. It went from holding off Bill Elliott to holding off Sterling Marlin, and Sterling Marlin just tried to kill me. Is we're gonna come take the white flag? <laughs> I think this is my first try at this one. It's been a while since I've one shot at one. Yes, off three and four. Casey Atwood's gonna win his first career Winston Cup race. That's the way to win these things. Great job. Wow. Well, boys, we've made it. The last challenge. I've been recording in this particular recording session for two hours and 20 minutes. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this together at all. But let's take control of Johnny Benson and pass Ryan Newman at my arch nemesis, Charlotte and end this thing. For old time's sake, we'll blow three and four one more time. Oh, God. Car tried to kill me in one and two, it's okay. Car tried to kill me in three and four. It's okay. White flag. Come here, boy. Oh, that's not what I. Not what I meant to do. How am I out of contention? I was still leading. Of course, we couldn't one shot the last challenge. Right up next to the wall was pretty right there. You can't win a race if there's no car to finish with. Sure I can. All right, coming to the white. One chance. Not one chance, because I can literally do it over, but. Let him see the passenger side door in the mirror. I'm not sure I'm a professional, but I'm a challenge winner, baby. And just like that, we've done it. Wow. Well, and there you have it. All 30 lightning challenges complete here in NASCAR Thunder 2003. It was a lot of fun. I wish, again, I talked about this in my last video. I wish NASCAR games were good and they would bring stuff like this back and all the in-depth stuff in the career mode and all kinds of stuff like that, man. Like these games are, I mean, this game, I haven't played 04 yet. I've done a test run simulation but um but 04 is pretty similar i mean these games are so good with 
the little stuff that makes sport games so cool. And NASCAR is a sports game. So um, if you guys liked it, make sure to hit the like button. Uh, subscribe if you enjoyed it and you want to see more stuff like this. And comment down below what you want to see me do next. Uh, probably going to do lightning challenges in NASCAR Thunder 2004 next. Uh, career mode coming, I'm not sure. Shut up. I'm not sure if it's going to be NASCAR Thunder 2003 or 2004 that the career mode's in. But, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it's not too long, and we'll see you later. Peace.